Okay, you guys have been really patient, and it's time for another Marilyn Manson video. Now we finally got another update. Um, so Marilyn Manson has another woman who says that she was abused. So this is like what 13, 14? I'm starting to lose counts. And this comes from FBI agents. So they've done some digging and they found another woman or another woman has came forward to the FBI and has revealed some of her story. So we're going to look at it and see what she's got to say. Now, I can't pronounce this name. Bertiaka Eileen, um, that's the woman who has the claims, um, says that Marilyn Manson forcefully kissed her in 1995 when she was 16. In an interview with The Sun, Eileen said that Marilyn Manson had a sexual relationship with her three years later. Wow, so this is way back, 1995. I bet most of you weren't even born yet. I wasn't born in 1995. So, um, here's a quote from her. Cool. It was a very confusing relationship, and I look back, I feel like I was emotionally abused, she told the British tabloid. I was in love with him. I thought it was mutual. I just wanted a regular relationship with him. Okay, so Marilyn Manson with 16-year-olds. Uh, I, I don't think that's a new story. Um, but, <laughs> wow. Why did she wait so long? 1995? That's like, what, 20, 25? I, I can't do math. But, like, 20 years later? 24 years later? So, yeah, 24 years later? Wow, she really was holding on to this. Um, I haven't heard of this um, Bertinica Eileen person. I, I, I doubt I'm saying her name right, but check the article in the description and tell me how to say her name. Um, I always have to say that. Check the article in the description because I have people who are like, oh, where's the link to the article? Where's the link to the article? I always say the link to the article is in the description. Check it. Um, I might just post in the comments section so, since so many people just don't check the descriptions. Okay, so, oh, she's an actress. So, Eileen, an actress, alleged that Marilyn Manson would be very sweet one minute, and then he'd de degrade me in front of his friends. Ooh, this story is not is not different. I think he said the Game of Thrones actress, he, like, humiliated her, too. But, yeah, Marilyn Manson likes to um, humiliate people, apparently. Let's, let's go on. She said when she was with his entourage, or a group of guys, he would say things to me that I was fat. I was five foot ten and one hundred twenty pounds at the time. That's not fat. I mean, that's roughly the same. That's roughly around the same weight my girlfriend is, and she's pretty skinny. The worst was, um, she told me I looked like a dirty Mexican whore because I had olive skin. I don't mean to laugh, but that's just. That's just something mean to say in front of his friends. Like, I don't have a picture of her. Uh, I don't know what she looks like. The article doesn't have a picture of her, so I, I really can't look at it. It has a bunch of pictures of Marilyn Manson, though, but no pictures of the actual alleged victim. Um, he would purposely say things that made me feel bad about myself. So, yeah, I guess a lot of emotional abuse. Uh, I'm not really seeing any physical abuse in the article. Um... Okay, there's more. Um, so she's 41 right now, and she, yeah, she had an FBI meet. She had an FBI meeting in Maryland. Wow! Shout out to my home state. I'm gonna tell the FBI everything I know, and I hope they don't let us down. She told the Sun. They are taking this very, very seriously, which they should. Yes, come on, FBI. Give us the. Give us some real solid proof. Me and all my subscribers, all the Marilyn Manson fans out there, all the rock and music fans in general, we are waiting to see if Marilyn Manson is actually guilty or if he's innocent. I think I think he's guilty. I know I said innocent until proven guilty, but I, I think th there's just so much stuff against him. Some has to be true, man. Um, Okay, she added, I said, okay, so she said, one day, all right, one day, um, I can't take this anymore, so I contacted the emergency tip line. He terrorized us through. It was intimidating because I never talked to an emerg an FBI agent before. Um, 
She was very nice, but I was still scared. Um, let's see. Um, so, yeah, that's about it. And it just goes into, like, uh, more Evan Wood stuff that we have already talked about. So, my opinion, uh, emotional abuse, not really seeing any physical abuse, but uh, in my opinion, I think emotional abuse is just as bad as um, physical abuse. You know, if you have, like, someone that you love and respect, you tell all your deepest secrets to, and then they just turn around just call you Mexican whore and, like, all these negative stuff and just spit on you and stuff. It, it, it's horrible, so... I think I think emotional abuse should be taken just as seriously as physical abuse, um, cause it will damage you just psychologically. Like moving forward with your life, um, with um your future relationships, how you view yourself, uh, um, what your lover says to you is very important. It's even more important than what they think of themselves sometimes. So. Yeah, we finally got some new Marilyn Manson news. Uh, I told you I was going to have a new Marilyn Manson video this week. Um, I've I kind of just been slacking last week because I was like, I have so many other things I want to talk about and so many other news stories I want to talk about. But my Marilyn Manson videos is like what really put me on, I guess. So I, I just wanted to take a break from Marilyn Manson. It, it's really depressing talking about all this stuff. But yeah, back to talking about Marilyn Manson. Uh, I got some more videos tomorrow and stuff coming. So, yeah, stay tuned. Peace.